In today's tutorial, I am going to show you how to make a breaking news intro slide in PowerPoint. Also, I'm going to show you how to convert these slides into a video format. So this is how the slide works. When I click, it will show you the world map and then it comes the live breaking news. Again, it will show you two times and third time the breaking news will go off. So let's see how to do this in PowerPoint. Add a new slide, right mouse click, go to format background and change the color to the gradient fill. As you can see here, I have used this color combination of blue, the dark blue, light blue and more lighter shade. And whichever color which you feel better, you can just add it here. The next thing, I'm just going to add the text. Go to insert text box and I'm just typing in capital letters breaking. You can see here and I'm going to change the font color to white. And here I'm going to use the font called Oswald or whichever font you feel better, you can use it. You can see here, I'm going to make it uh, maybe 88 and bold and I'm making it center aligned and then go to insert shapes. And from basic shapes, I'm going to select this parallelogram, just select depending on the size of the text and shape outline make it no outline and shape fill make it white and not white sorry you just make it maybe a darker red or you can just go to more fill colors customs and you can increase the you can see here and just say send to back so you can see here this is breaking news and then I'm going to select this red, press Ctrl D, this parallelogram, reduce the size and change this color to maybe yellow. And here I'm going to say live, press Ctrl D, this one, reduce the text. And I'm going to make it live. And you can change the color to maybe to blue. You can see here live. And then I'm going to add one more at the bottom. And this will be, I'm going to make it a white color. You can see here. And this I'm going to again duplicate by pressing Ctrl D. And I will say news i'll not make it bold i'll remove the bold somewhat reduce the size and this color i'm going to make it to again blue and add it here so you can see here we have just added the live breaking news now i'm just going to do the animation and before giving the animation you can add uh, some uh, world map or something like that so which uh, I'm just going to paste it here. You can see here I have a, this map which is editable. I'll go to format and then just send to back. So you can see here I have added the map and then you can see here the breaking news. Now let's do the animation. Go to animation tab, click on animation pane. And first one I'm just going to select this one live. Before that, let me just group this two the yellow text and the live, the yellow background, press Ctrl G and this also breaking and the red background and the news also. You can see here. Now I want this to come from the left side. So for that, I'm going to give an animation which is fly in. You can see here fly in. I'll just say from left. So it comes from left. Double click this one. And I'm going to make it a bounce end and timing you can make it fast or very fast depending on your requirement so it comes something like this so you can give the first text uh, sorry the animation to the map also for that I'm going to give a, a fade effect you can see here slowly that comes so that will be my first animation and then the text animation so this one I can say with previous this one will come after previous 
now i'm going to select this animation painter click on this one so this one instead of coming from left i want this to come from right you can see here and this should happen maybe with previous a little bit delay and then again i'm going to select this animation painter so this is perfectly all right and this should also happen with previous and let me just see here so it comes something like this if you want we can give more animation for example i want to give some zoom animation to this also so for this i'm going to select this just don't go and change the animation otherwise it will override the uh, existing animation what you have to do is you have to select add animation then go to more entrance effects and you can just select the zoom animation here can you see a zoom and the zoom should happen with this one this one you can see here i'm just going to bring this here and i will just say with previous so if i play it comes something like this you can see here the zoom effect all right if you want you can give the zoom effect to the news also so this is the one slide now if you want this to be repeated uh, two times or three times then you can just right mouse click and just say duplicate slide so what happens here if I play this is coming one and again this is coming second time and then we can set the duration here we can go to the transition and we can set the duration after three seconds this should come so automatically this will go For example I will just select here and I will say after three seconds so if I just play you can see here after three seconds again started coming so you can see two times it has come so this is the the two slides i made it the intro and then i want to make a third slide right mouse click duplicate slide and this time this should go off first the breaking you should come and then this text should go off so i cannot use this particular uh, this is all entrance uh, animations i have to just change this to uh the exit animations you can see here when i go to the animations we have got different animation so this is the entrance effects now i have to make it the exit effects i can delete all or i can simply select one by one for example this one this is with entrance you can see here and similarly i'm just going to change this one i'll not say add animation if i say add animation then it's going to add one more animation so i'll just select here and I'll just go to more exit effects and I will just say fade here so you can see here it is going off you can see here and then similarly this also I'm just going to select and the fly in which is entrance effect here again I'll go to the more exit effects and I will just say fly out you can see here fly out I want this to go towards right see here and this should happen again with previous a uh, little bit delay you can again for this also i'm just going to select the same more exit effects and again fly out and this also fly out should go towards the left because it has come from this side so it has to go to the left side and this should also happen with previous a uh, little bit of delay and this also i'm just going to make it more entrance uh, exit effects and this also fly out fly out i'll make it to right again with previous and a little bit delay so let's see let let's play these three slides how it looks when i click live breaking news second time it comes automatically and then the third time it goes off now let's see how to convert this uh, particular slides to a video go to file and you can see something called export here i'm using office 365 version maybe you've got some different uh, versions some different places 
so here in office 365 there's something called export and then we have got a create a video when i say create a video i've got a variety of options you can see ultra hd full hd depending on your size you can just select for example i want full hd and here it says seconds spent on each slide for example i want to spend say three seconds on each slide that means my video will be three slides that means three into three nine seconds video will be there and then if you have some audio also you can just create uh, use recorded timings and narration so if you have any audio uh, inserted in the slide that will also be recorded or if you don't want you can just simply say don't use uh, recorded timings and narrations so let me just say create video now and here it i'm just asking me i'll just say breaking news intro let me click save button and here you can see here it will take some time depending on your pc it's creating almost going to complete done now let me just show you the video you can see here this is total a nine seconds video as i said and when i play you can see here the first slide comes and then the second slide and the third slide goes off so this is the nine second video that's it from me friends thank you for watching my youtube channel and don't forget to subscribe powerpoint university see you soon with more interesting stuff till then goodbye